Previously on Spinelli Speaks. And <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> Stop! I'm sorry. Hi everyone, Danny here. Welcome back to my channel. Today is another day of Vlogmas and I hope you have been enjoying your Vlogmas feed. I have to apologize about the lighting here because I am in a very cozy setting because I am starting my first cozy Christmas read of the month. I'm so excited. I've got my little reading pals here with me. We have Kingston and Dwight. We all have a cozy blanket to sit with as we, or I read. <laughs> I even have a really cozy ASMR on. It has some Christmas music playing and snow in the background. Um, I will link in the description the one I'm watching. But I'm going to go ahead and dive into Debbie Maycomber's Mrs. Miracle because this is the one that I was most looking forward to read. Um, and I'm just really excited for this. So I have a couple um, of moments here that I can get some reading in. I'm hoping to get maybe halfway through. Who knows? But at the end of this vlog, I'll tell you what I thought of the book as a whole. So, happy reading. Okay, so I've gotten a couple of pages in and it's pretty clear where this story is going. This is about Seth and his two boys. They are twins and they are about six years old. His wife was killed in a car accident, um, so they're on their own and they're going through housekeepers pretty quickly. Um, so I'm gathering that Mrs. Miracle is gonna come in the form of a housekeeper and help this family find their way. And I'm guessing there may be an additional um, member added at some point because it wouldn't be a Christmas time Debbie Maycomber without a little bit of a love story. So <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, everyone, so it is the next day and I finished Mrs. Miracle last night and it was so good. Like, I read this in a day because I couldn't stop reading it. It was just so sweet. Um, it's about two people that have been hurt in their lives and that pain is something that they share, but they also share a lot of other things. But it gives them a better understanding of each other and um, their ability to have a second chance. I really love how Debbie Maycomber also puts in a little bit of sprinkling of some side characters as well. Um, we get to see the relationship of um, more of a um, an older couple. So this couple is like in their 60s. So they've been married for like 40 years. And they're going through some hard times and it's really beautiful how that gets um, interwoven into the story and then there's one little side character like busybody character and I really like her too because it really reminds you to keep your nose out of other people's business <laughs> so anywho if you're looking for a cute cozy Christmas time book um, faith-based it's really beautiful I really liked this one. I really like all of the Mrs. Miracle books. So if you're looking for something really um, cute for Christmas that has a recurring character, um, definitely check out Debbie Maycomber's Mrs. Miracle. But yeah, that was great. I can't wait to get on to my other books. Um, I don't know which one I'm going to pick. This one was an easy pick. I knew I wanted to read this right away. So now out of the other books, I don't know which one I'm going to pick next. But until tomorrow, I hope you're all reading something great, taking care and staying safe. As always, you know how it goes. Happy reading. Bye.